Well, if they weren't, we wouldn't be at AK-47 Stadium here in Hexon, Texas. Bring your body armor to the stadium or wear a body bag for the ride home in the hearse. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The New York Tyrants go up against the Hexon Oilers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's time to tune in, turn on, and drop what you're doing because MFL Game Day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. So what's the game plan for the home team today, Bricks? Uh, I think they got to keep it simple. A little cough syrup, maybe smoke a little untidy pod pregame so they can keep their heads in the game. I mean, literally. You don't want to get decapitated on the opening kickoff. I say go after the refs early and often. No mercy. a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. It's first and ten. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Functioning brain cells before that hit. They're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh, the strawberry field's dirty trick. As my mentor Hunter used to say, I don't advocate drugs, alcohol, narcotics, or insanity to anyone, but they've always worked for me. Second down in a very lot. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two, hot. that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 
And that is called for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Oh, sure. Now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him. Not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Hot two. Hot Picks up maybe four on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And this guy looks like Thor, and he runs it in for the touchdown. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. That'll be second down and four. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. See this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And it's first and ten. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. And it's first and ten. Target on that throw. Second down and ten. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback could be hurting, or dead, or worse. down and never going to happen. A nice run there for eight yards. Thank God he's still got his leg. 
He's going to need all of it for this kick. The kick is good. As expected. Those are pretty. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. Man, this coach must have. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. He's gone. You know, the ref's job is very tough, Bricks. Uh, even tougher when he's dead, I would imagine. <laughs> well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. One, hot two, hot. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. Hot. Hot. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. In a fight between King Kong and Godzilla, the player on Roid Rage would win. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh... <clears throat> He picks up a two. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. And that takes us to the two minute warning. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five.
And it's first and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense. It's two-yard run before he stopped. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And that'll be second and eight to go. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frozen at the mouth. Oh, that guy? Oh, is it that one? Look that one over there. Now just follow the screen, Bricks. Oh, yeah, that's way easier. Thanks, Grim. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. Third down and, well, good luck. And a nice pass for a 10-yard gain. Uh, it's not a first down in the stat line, but it's a first down. Smart move there as they call a timeout trying to get the ball back for another shot. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is in palm grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off-season. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot... Dirt sandwich. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. Second down in a lot. Hot, hot one, hot two. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling that time out to stop our own clock. You know, Grim? That's a catch for a four-yard game. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. Third quarter about to begin here, and these guys are locked in a nearly dead heat. I was locked in a dead heat under the covers last night when Bricks started farting like a 4th of July fireworks finale. What you talking about? <laughs> when you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. should throw it and catch it too. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Ouch! What is this? Andy's wrestling? Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two. one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hey. 
Second down and long. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. And the ball raises through the defense, cutting a defender in half. That means you can wrap up the other half. And first down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. First down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Oh, with the punishing hit. Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Hot three. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Hot, hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Talk for the first down. Ah, oh, that is such bullshit. I got money on this game. These guys need to talk to the ref about those calls. And by talk, I mean stop them into the ground. Are you They're back up here on first, and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. Boom! And it's first and ten. They need to make him a target more often. 
And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First and eight to go. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. He picks up five on that play. <laughs> Second down and five. Hot. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and five. Hot one. Hot. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Man, what a hit that was. That's the end of the third quarter. This game is going to come down to the wire. I love that show. And it's first and ten. That's a six-yard gain. <laughs> and that'll be second down and four. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Whoa. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Second down in a very lot. And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about 10 on that play. Hey, he makes up a name for himself every night. That's how he stays ahead of the bounty hunters. He's wanted in 50 states. He had it for a second there. This is going to be a long kick. Let's see if he can make it. Straight through the uprights.
When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make a pay. And it's first and ten. Not one. Yeah, avoid rage. Because if you can't answer your question, oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. And he scores! Well, it's all fun and games until he tries break dancing. Yep, let's go, Vince. It's all much more. Let him out. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. With a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And the defense calls a Strawberry Fields dirty trick. You now this takes me back to those crazy days of my youth, Bricks. <laughs> Good times. Buried a little Swedish midget look, and he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, boy. And it's first and ten. Hey. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! And they come to the line trying to tie this up with two points. And if they don't, things are going to get weird and desperate on their sideline. And they run it in for two points. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. That's a lousy kickoff. Are they paying that guy or is he somebody's cousin?
And it's first and ten. Freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room straight through the uprights they're looking for a good return after giving up points let's see how they do yeah let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing with the brain scrambler. And the quarterback goes into a hurry up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. That's a killer. It was right there and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock and he better win. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two minute drill. somehow and hold on for the first down this guy has a nice set of hands grim it's the third set of hands he's had so long today looks like it's a good fit and it's for to use their second time out but they are running out of time a bit pessimistic don't you think so grim it's more about building tension bricks that's all we do at this point and drink this bourbon come on give me that Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. That's right, folks. It's all tied up, and we are headed to overtime. I don't know how many players are left alive, but the rest are headed to sudden death. They should call this game Mutant Death League. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. Pick up 
seven yards on that play. Second and three. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade! Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. First down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. his way out of it. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. And that'll bring up third and one. Talk about Butterfingers. He should have had that one. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, Oh, what a brutal hit! Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole! Hey, asshole, up here! Talking to you! He's got the distance, and the kick is good! The Oilers spoiled the opposition chance to win and walk away victorious. It was quite a nail-biter today. They came up big with a one-point win to seal the victory. Who wants wings? I do. Make them extra spicy. I like it when they come out hotter than when they go in. Oh, no. Please don't. You know, he lives on my shoulder, and it's going to get messy. 
I'm buying. Let's listen to the MVP. Maybe he wants some wings too. Bryn Blitro with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...